I was thinking about Valentine's Day, about that being about love. And a new thought came to me. Real love doesn't love to get, but loves to give. Had you thought of that? When I think of loving like the great grandbabies, the grandchildren, John, Kim, Roger, you you think of of giving. You think, I mean, you're just around the house here and all of a sudden you think, I should go cook some, some pork chops and maybe put on some potato soup because uh, Roger's out working on the Jeep. When he comes in, he'll be hungry. Uh, you just think, I, I need to do something. <laughs> uh, love just makes you do that. Um, we were somewhere the other day and and saw something that just just came over me. I, I, I should get that. That's a very good thing to give. Yeah. And um, there's so many times that love says, I want to do something for you. I think about the the, the thousands of times that Roger has during these months uh, of cancer treatments that he's just wanted to do. Um, I'll get you some wheat thins because you've been able to eat those. I, I think of uh, like George and Missy at church um, brought me some crackers that I had admired at, uh, at an event and they got me some crackers and brought me some cheese. Love just says give. Um, my secret sister um, did this whole thing about uh, the, the taking the bath and, and being a candle and being all these lotions and um, love reaches out and gives. Have you thought Jesus died to give you the love that would help you repent and convert and come and live in heaven with him? He died to give us heaven and to give us every day a good day with him. Wow. Valentine's Day tomorrow, who can you give love to?